Hello, gentlemen. Patrick Ryan here, founder of Wingman for You. We help men find the women of their dreams by teaching them how to approach women with confidence. Now, guys, this video is about the F word. That's right, the F word. And no, I do not mean the F bomb. I mean the F word as in feelings. Oh my gosh, feelings, guys. I'm talking emotional feelings. How you can feel your feelings so that you can get the love that you want. Now, guys, if you're the type of gentleman who really wants a woman in her life, but you can't be vulnerable and you can't allow yourself to be who you are, then this video is ideal for you. Now, the emotions and the release of feelings is best depicted in Two and a Half Men, Season 5, Episode 18. What we find is Alan and Jake are arguing because Jake has a homework assignment due on Monday morning and he's lost the book. He's supposed to do a book report and he has no idea where his book is. So Alan says, we're going to the bookstore, we're buying that book and you're getting your assignment done before Monday. Okay, so Charlie accompanies them. Well, while Jake and Alan are off looking for the book, Charlie approaches the attendant and says, gosh, I'm interested in finding books on how I can have a better romantic relationship. And the gentleman says, well, you need to look in the self-help section and points him in the right direction. So while Charlie's there looking through several books, a beautiful older woman walks up and approaches him and she asks Charlie how he's doing. He says, well, gosh, I'm looking for a book in which I can help, that can help me be able to have an authentic relationship, a romantic relationship with a woman. And he looks at her and says, wow, um, you're quite beautiful. And she says, thank you. And she reaches over and grabs a book off the shelf and hands it to him. And Charlie's like, wow, this looks like it's right up my alley, exactly what I'm looking for. And she looks at Charlie and says, listen, if you can't be vulnerable at any level, then you have a hard time feeling your own feelings. And if you have a hard time feeling your feelings, you're really never going to have an authentic romantic relationship with a woman. And Charlie says, well, yeah, I guess maybe that is who I am. He starts looking at the book and looks at the back cover and realizes that this woman is the author of the book. And he's like, wow, can I get your autograph? She, of course, signs the book for him. And he looks at her and he says, you know, I would love to learn more about what you know. Would you care to have coffee? She goes, yes, that would be great. Charlie pays for the book and the two of them leave the bookstore, leaving, of course, Alan and Jake behind. Now, Alan and Jake, of course, get in an argument. They eventually purchase the book they're looking for. They look for Charlie. They can't find him anywhere. Unfortunately, Alan and Jake have to take the bus home back to Malibu. Meanwhile, back at the Malibu house, where again, Jake has now lost the book again and realizes he thinks he left it on the bus. And of course, Alan's pissed. And in walks Charlie. And he's like, where have you been? We had to take two buses. We had to walk along Highway 1 all the way home in rush hour traffic. And we almost got killed. And Charlie, of course, doesn't care. He says, Alan. I'm going to transform myself to get the intimacy I want. And Alan's like, yeah, right, whatever. And he says, no, really, I met this woman at the bookstore and she wrote this book and it's amazing. And she's telling me that I need to be vulnerable and I need to feel my feelings. And she said to me that because I can't feel my feelings, that I'm a prisoner in jail, that my feelings are all bottled up and I can't get out. And he's like, yeah, whatever, you left us in the bookstore. Charlie goes on to say, listen, the good news is I'm also the warden, meaning I can let myself out. I can express my emotions authentically and vulnerably and know that my identity won't be compromised. And guys, that's exactly what we men need to do. We need to be more emotional. Remember, if we're going to capture the heart of a woman, we have to show our emotions and we have to capture her emotions. So guys, the next time you're out on a date or you're just in front of a woman that you're a little trepidatious about approaching, go over there, build up that insecurity, get rid of that insecurity by lowering your expectations, by just having the courage to go over 
and say hi. And if you're out on that date, guys, be vulnerable. Tell her some of the things that perhaps you're insecure about. Women love that. These are the things that bring us closer together and create a strong bond. Guys, I really hope this video has helped you get a little bit closer to finding the woman of your dreams. Please subscribe to my channel as there's some fantastic videos in there that will help you get that much closer to the woman of your dreams. Thanks again for tuning in and I'll see you in the next video.